Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commencing the 2nd of December 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, find your purpose, create your future, to raise your consciousness, come out of that spiritual closet and take the steps on your path, your life purpose, so that you can spread your wings and soar. Now, this week we're going to be using Goddess Love Oracle Cards by Wendy Andrew. But as always, before we get into this week's reading, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you so, so much. And thank you to those that have been joining me on a Friday at 3 p.m., live on Facebook and YouTube where I've been doing my meditation and oracle card weekend reset. It's been absolutely amazing. If you haven't called to the show yet, you can watch the replay. But if you do get a chance, join me live every Friday, 3 p.m., um, where you get to choose which deck of cards I use. I pull a card and then do a guided meditation for it. And three lucky people actually get a card pulled for them. And exciting news um this thursday the 5th of december i will be going live with a new podcast with the beautiful lovely sally hart which is going to be a cup of spirituality tea where sally and i will be answering the most basic questions you have about spiritual matters angels chakras whatever it is any esoteric subject you, we will be answering the questions. So if you're new to this and you've got no idea what a chakra is or how to connect with your angel or what are runes, anything like that, we are there to answer those questions. So please do tune into that. So as always, I give the cards a quick cleanse and a bless. So what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good? The week commences in the 2nd of December 2024. What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good? The week commences in the 2nd of December 2024. So let's see what cards want to come out today for us. Okay. So we have got Rebirth. Let go of the ties that bind. Journey, your life is a sacred gift. And reflection, healing transformation. Okay, so what the cards are saying um, for you this week is that it's time to let go of the things that are holding you back, things that no longer serve you you know let go of those ties this is your chance to actually create a new you um you, you know we're coming into the season now you know where we're going to take time to reflect go out maybe party meet people and this is will give you the opportunity to see the people places the things that you do that no longer serve you and they're no longer for your highest good, no longer feel right, you're going to get the chance this week to actually reset to rebirth. You know, just remember that your life is a journey. You know, it's a sacred gift. You chose to be here in physical form at this moment in time. So enjoy the journey. You know, don't let doubt, fear or outside influences affect where you're going. You know, go within, stay true to your own true north, to who you are and where you are going. You know, and this ties in with releasing stuff that is stopping you from being who you truly are. Rebirth, step into who you are truly meant to be. You know, and if need be, take some time for reflection this week. What healing do you need to do, whether physically, mentally or emotionally? You know, when you cut ties, sometimes you have to heal from those. Take the time to do that. Don't rush forward with things. You know, life is a journey. You don't have to do everything immediately. It can take time. Just, just heal, enjoy, savour. 
you don't need to rush you know you don't need that rebirth doesn't need to be oh right i'm going to create a new life for me tomorrow take the time to do it you know do take one step at a time untie each thing one at a time you don't need to sever untie heal go within reflect and create that new you ready for when 2025 comes in and that's really all the guidance i'm being given this week as always this is my interpretation of the cards and you may get a completely different interpretation and that is absolutely fine i draw these cards for what you need to know for your highest good so the first card is rebirth let go of the ties that bind what is it that is holding you back stopping you from becoming who you are truly meant to be. Journey, your life is a sacred gift. Savour, enjoy being alive. You know, life is a journey. You don't need to rush it. Take your time. Reflection, healing transformation. Reflect on how far you've come in your life. You know, what do you need to heal from if you're releasing those ties? what you know what healing needs to take place if any and take that journey with that reflection so please do let me know in the comments or message me privately i always reply to everyone who um comments and what was interesting is rebirth came out came out for one of the people um, who got a free reading um on friday so you know the fact it's come out a second time for everyone here means that it's a real card that you you do need to look into that people do need to um take time with um so don't forget to uh check out the new show on thursday and obviously um my uh card reading and meditation on friday and don't forget to check out my Angels and Destiny show, which if you're watching this today, is taking place tomorrow, Monday the 2nd at 8 p.m. UK time. And if you're watching on Mondays um, this evening, and if you're watching later in the week, then watch the replay of the show. Um, I've got a lovely lady called Anne Alexson um, on the show, and I'm really looking forward to that conversation. It's absolute, it was an absolutely amazing conversation so please do join us for that conversation and don't forget to check out everything i do future life past life angelic crakey you know you can have a free 20 minute and um, video clarity one-to-one -one call with me if you were if you are so inclined um and maybe i'll pull a card or two for that anyway have a wonderful week take care bye